Hi, everyone, and welcome back to MND. I play Boku no Setsu Yasumi 2. That was not the actual word, but we're just going to go with it. Yeah, wow. <laughs> um, I had like four different Japanese words in my head at one time there. And That's why I just call it My Summer Vacation. Then, it, I don't have to, then I don't have to think about it. Yeah. Uh, welcome back to My Summer Vacation 2. Um, it's me, Dia. That's Em over there, who is, you know. Hello aghast at my intro but that's okay um they're allowed to be you know on the on the power rankings of podcast people i, I, I this isn't a podcast but whatever this is how i think of the world uh -huh. um, of podcasters in incapable of saying japanese names you are not even in the top 10 so well yeah i'm not rob sackney <laughs> yes the high on the list is rob sackney <laughs> pronouncing things like uh he's british i'm like you're not british you can't get away with this it's see it's really funny because the one that the one thing that really fucks me up and you you rightfully grilled me for this um you really scared me and you scared me in the zachney manner for this um what i said pat labor oh yeah but that's because fuck? in my head the only time i ever see a b o r at the end of words is in spanish so my brain just instantly made that a spanish word and i was like yes yeah, see pat labor um and that's what happened there okay yeah um it's like how whenever i try and teach sarah uh spanish words um they can't not pronounce them in a russian way because like they did russian and french and so it's either a french pronunciation or a russian pronunciation it's like no that's not that's not spanish what are you doing but yeah um all right let's go next day I'm excited for the drama of the day. I like that we get like a different breakfast spread. Yeah. Like it's not just a generic breakfast, even though I don't think we can ask like, hey, what was breakfast this morning? I think we can only do that for dinner, but we still got a unique one. Okay. So we've got a thing to do in the clinic. Uh, in the evening, Ghost Girl. Um, could you check the day? I think it's the 15th, but I want to double check. Yeah, it is the 15th. Yeah, it's 15th. Okay. So we don't have anything to do other than Ghost Girl. So I would say water the plants. Uh, we got an axe, so let's go fucking chop down that tree. Yeah, we got the axe. I forgot about that. We're a child who. I like that we stole the axe. Yeah. That's, that's... Well, they're not going to give us an axe. We're a child. Well, I know. Well, I mean, I got an axe as a child. I would not have been given an axe as a child, probably. Uh, no, I should not have been given an axe as a child, but I was I was given an axe and the Boy Scouts handbook. Out there into the yard. Oh, wait. No, yeah. Green room, right? No, not the green Not the back. <laughs> it's right there. Yes. Oh, that's right. Yeah, this is this. That's why I think it's the green room because I see the the green carpet there when I we exit. But I forgot that. I mean, yeah, it'll take us there, but it's, it's two extra screens. Yeah. Big. Yeah, I guess you can check the asshole bugs if you want. Big, you piece of shit. Yatta. Nope. Get out of here. Disgusting. It's the funny thing about this is like eventually these blooms should be withering. Like they shouldn't be yes. blooming this much and this long. But um uh all right, so uh forward. Yeah. And then left. Left. <laughs> oh wait, yeah, no, that's right. This is this is the way to Oh. Oh hey. Hi, we have an axe. Yeah. Ah, ああ。私ももう終戦記念日か。僕くん。僕の夏休み。もう半分終わっちゃったね。そうだね。ねえおばちゃん。お盆と終戦記念日が重なってるのって何か理由があるの?うん。どうなんだろう。でも、みんなで
明治の最初の頃に旧暦から新暦に暦が変わってそれで一月ずれちゃったんだってへえー、そうなんだ2月の節分でお豆をまく時「鬼は外ふわーうち」って言うじゃないあれは去年の役を払って新年の服を招き入れるって意味なのそう考えるとなんだかお正月の行事みたいでしょあれもお盆と同じ理由でお正月が移動しちゃったから少々不思議なことになっちゃってるのよ OK Thanks No, dog, down the right path. Oh, son of a bitch. To the right. <laughs> this is not faster. You're not making this faster. No, but it was more fun for me. Look at him go. Oh, damn. Yes, They should not have given this child the opportunity yes. to steal an axe. <clears throat> what an impressively clean stump, Boku. Yeah, now let's, uh, let's go. See what's on the other side. Maybe that guy who's stuck on the mountain is over here. Go. Oh. Oh, we are new. Okay. So, yeah, I guess there's up there's the hut. That... Yeah, that's where the water wheel is. Okay. okay. Well, then up we go. I feel like I'm supposed to be like whipping out a sword and like whomping like rabbits in this field. Just big, big secret of mono vibes going on now. Um, um, there's up and then there's a cross. Cross takes us to. I mean, they both the dead end, so yeah. I, according to the map. Let's, so I guess we can go up and we can go back to the water wheel way on our way back. Yeah, that's fine. Does that make sense or. Oh, huh. Um, can we look at that dirt patch? Is that anything? <laughs> it's just like. No? Okay. Nope. Uh, oh, what about on the other side of that tree? Will that make the screen change? Yes, it does. Just thank you. No. No, okay. Nothing over here. Oh. Oh. Damn. Huh. Okay. Oh. Uh -huh. Okay. Hope you get down. Get, get, get down, my guy. You've doomed him. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um, over and across the thing, I guess? Yep. Check the woodshed first, yeah. I don't know, kid. You ran up to it. That's a new one. Yeah. Japanese rhino. Oh. Tiny. Yeah, it's tiny. We don't, we don't want that. Okay. So, uh, check the woodshed, like that wood pile, and then the other uh, the oven. I guess it's an oven. Bundles of fresh, thin wood are piled up. A pleasant pine scent. Let's search the scent of burnt wood. Okay. Okay. It's a wooden workbench covered in saw and nail marks. It looks like a perfect spot to have a sunny picnic. There's an incinerator. It's old and rusty. There's even some holes in it. OK. 
Okay. It's a book titled Our Li Lives in the Forest from the South Yuzu Charcoal Producers Association. Okay. Go. Mm, oh. The inside of the cabin is surprisingly tidy. All right. So. I figured, like, the dude's dad was going to be just, like, you know, living in a hovel um, in his own filth, but apparently no. not. I got on the pier. Let's see what's out there. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. The other side of the water wheel. Spin it. Just as I lightly touched the water wheel, it began to turn. Okay. And then all the poison left the zone. Okay. Yeah, then... don't jump in the water. No. I was hoping there'd be like stuff up here, but it doesn't really look like yeah. it, huh? I was thinking we can jump down there and then walk. Well, we've already been down there. There's nothing down yeah, there. Yeah, no, I was just, it was just like, it's a weird uh, little shortcut back. I was hoping there'd be like a person, rocket uh -huh. parts, you know, the stuff we're looking for in this video game. <laughs> Why isn't the video game about not really being a video game not letting me do the video game stuff? Okay. Well. I guess that's that. There's no person up here right now. Yeah, no. Which is interesting because, like, the dude's dad was supposed to be stuck on the mountain. Yes. I mean, maybe this isn't the thing. You know, maybe. But I don't know what else it could be. Where is that? No. Okay, well, yeah. I mean, let's just go back. Yeah. yeah. Um, I would say while we're here, we could check that guy and we could maybe check the graveyard, see if there's someone in the graveyard. Yeah. Since it's Elbon and stuff. Maybe that monk's still around. Hey, we, we, we fixed the path to your dad. You remember your dad? Do you remember that you have one? Talk to him. Talk to him. Yeah, <laughs> Oni chan to Yasko Naita no koto ga suki na no? Yeah. Damn. Hmm. Dona ndaro. Nukashi ya kyodai mi tani omotte da kara. Kangae ta koto mo nakatta kedo. Dona ndaro. Wakan nai ya. Embarrassing kid. ちゃん、誰のお墓参りをしているの離婚した元亭主とそのお母さんよ。元亭主、安子や光のパパなんだけど、結構いいやつなんだ。こんなに早く死んじゃうんだったら逃げないでもっと本格的に喧嘩してあ
Yeah. I know where that is. I didn't even think to check that I should have, but... I was just like, oh, it's just a crawfish place, but... Oh, yeah, here. Hell yeah. There you go. Okay. I say we wait a day to give that to him because it'll uh, probably automatically fill out a part of our journal when we do. Yeah. So we might as well save it for a day where we don't have anything else going on. Gamer behavior. <laughs> well, we got to maximize Boku's diary. Otherwise, they'll be like, oh, nothing happened that day. It's like, no kid. Everything happened on like a Thursday. Some days, a thousand things happen, it's, you know? It's, yeah. Anyway, now we can probably head to the clinic. I bet it's probably afternoon. It is, yeah. See, now we're going to go so fast to the clinic, you don't even know. No okay. Look how fast we're going. That's true. We're zooming. It's not even afternoon yet. We fucked up. Is it? No, it's still Oh, yeah, day, it's still daytime. Yeah. Time is I guess it? we go talk to the old man. Oh, it's like, um, we're going to walk in and turn the afternoon, but we could go yeah. talk to the nurse, the old man. Two weeks off and you forgot which button is confirmed and which one is back out. That's, that's how it works. I forget mid playing this. Are you kidding me? Come on. <laughs> no, no. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hey, spooky ghost. そろそろ帰らなきゃいけないの。え? <laughs> It's also the time where I died. どうしてもどうしてもいかなきゃいけないの？その遠いところ。うん。そうなんだ。さようなら。うん。さようなら。元気でね。あれ？どうしたの？何か変なことを言った？いや。<笑> なんでもないよ。君といるとさて。ダイ、アゲスウィンドスチェル、ウィゴーシーユ、ザボートメンオーソンティン。yeah, let's go. Not like there's not much to do before dinner, so. Hey, Kembo. Yeah, Kembo. Good dude. Whoa, what? What? Kembo? Why'd you want to hook him? I didn't. You lost the dog. Hey, I want to see something. No. Nope, that's closed. Yeah. Go, go out the exit. We're gonna go look. We gotta go find that fucking dog. We're gonna find that dog. Gambo. All right, up or down. Down is toward the weird gate, right? I don't I don't remember. Kembo. Oh, it's Kembo. Oh. Nick. 
You let him out, you idiot! <laughs> I did not expect this to happen. Oh, Kemba, what? You can find a dead body. Is that bones? Yeah, it's bones. それがボロボロに汚れてなんだかほとんどわからなくなった犬のような生き物の鳴き殻だったねえ君は誰ケンボ also a ghost Okay Kenbo, go home. Uh, I assume this is the Kenbo event, so yeah. he's probably he'll probably go home. Okay. Let's. Well, um, okay, sure. That was uh, surprising. That was really unexpected. Um. Where the hell are we? The fastest way is just to go back home the way we came. Yeah. But we're gonna get stopped by. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna make it very far. I think we have like three screen transitions before he shows up, so. He's going to just appear in the it's clinic, clinic like right? a weirdo. <laughs> oh, there we go. Busy day. Busy fucking day. Yeah, busy day, but... This isn't even the day where I have something written down. Okay, well... Alright, I'd say talk to Simon and um, all the, the adult squad upstairs and then yeah. maybe check the fortune teller and... We already know what we're doing tomorrow. We gotta go get that key out of Shizue's room. Yeah. Oh, oh. Simon's not here. Yeah. <笑>好きな人ってもう何年も会ってないのうん。彼これ10年近くなるかな。10年思い続けるには何だか長すぎるよね。そうか。僕が生まれた頃の話か。あれ、お姉ちゃんって今年いくつだっけ。え。まあ
ほんとにいじわるで持ってきたの<笑>変なことを聞くとね。Alright, yeah, let's go、uh, take the bath exit. Maybe Simon's over there. Yeah. If not, it's fine. He's just chilling. Yeah, no. Boku's taken one bath in 15 days. Um, he swam a couple times. It's, it's true. It is a little、uh, concerning, I guess. It's not like he's rolling around the dirt, but he is running around sweaty in the middle of summer all day. <laughs> Okay. Fortune teller first. Fortune teller first. I think we call her the fortune teller. Oh, should we talk to Grandpa? Yeah, hit me. Get my notes out. Hey, Grandpa. Yeah, hit me. Get my notes out. Noon dock. That's、mm. not what we're doing because we're going to Shizui's room at, at noon. Oh, here we go. Guess how second floor balcony. Okay, we're gonna have a busy day tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Um, Dr. Gramps? Yeah, I might as well. All right. Oh. What's that? I'm going to go to the house. 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 わしに会いに来てくれるだろうしわしが死んでも墓に参ってくれるじゃろうって特に寂しくはないのじゃじゃがのう何数十年後今度は孫たちが死んだ時彼女らは多分わしと同じ墓には入らんだろう今こうして共に暮らしておる者がたとえ死んだ後とはいえ永久に離れ離れになるこれは何とも耐え難い悲しいことじゃなんだかよくわからないけどうんやっぱりよくわからないや<笑>いやいやこれは少々恥ずかしい話をしてしまったかなガッデムグランプス。Guess who's not back? Who's not back? Kembo. No,、oh, Kembo's not back. You're right. You're right. Nothing to do about it now,、yeah. but.、Yeah. Kembo's off the leash now. He, he's a free agent. He does whatever the fuck he wants. So, you know, 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 あれ変だな。なんで返してくれないんだろう。ねえ、お母さんさ、ここの鍵、あかねやに置いてってないかな。Oh, don't worry, we got it. <laughs> Alright, that's it for us.、Yeah. I like that the key has become like the, the door isn't about like. You know, healing a rift between this family. It's just like, no, we're just gonna go jack the key. <laughs> One might beget the other. It's true. So, Boku kun, any kikaite, oyasuminasai shimasho? Mm. Oba chan, 
おやすみなさい。What we got, Boku? What will today's story be? Chopping down the tree. Nope. Oh. Damn. Fair Damn, enough. Boku. That's... Boku's gonna go back to the mainland and, like, his mom's gonna be like, what the fuck happened with your, with your aunties? Yeah. Okay. New day. New day, new breakfast. Yo, so nanda. Oh, she's leaving the key? That's too, she's so shady. Not gonna talk to her daughter, but we'll leave the key when she goes back. Uh-huh. She said she's a scary witch. Yeah, no, she's uh, right about that one. Okay, so... Um, so we have the balcony, so we can go say goodbye to Shizue. Uh, we can go talk to her at noon or go. To, so I guess she's leaving at noon. So we should be at the dock to say goodbye to her because she's my, probably my favorite character. Yeah. So I guess <laughs> and then we can come back and get the key and then we take it to the, we can take it to the house. Yeah. And that'll basically be our day. So I guess first, let's go to the upstairs. Yeah. yeah. And then we can go water our plants. as We come back down. Oh, they're both asleep. Damn. Let's go knock on their doors. ねえ君、海を見るのは好きかな。うん、目の前にあるからよくわからないや。おばちゃん、昔さ、この町から出ていくちょっと前なんだけど、心の中がひどく悲しくなったんだ。悲しく?そう、悲しくて毎日海ば
今はちょっとしょうがないのよね僕にできることがあったら何でも言ってね<笑>うん分かったよそうだ今晩一緒のお布団で寝ようかえそれはちょっと<笑>なんでだって久しき中にも礼儀ありって言うじゃないえー、がっかりお姉ちゃん本当にがっかりしてるんだうんだって寂しいんだもん We're gonna hook you up with Simon, it'll be fine. I'm surprised they have not hooked up yet. <laughs> Go down the stairs, we gotta water our vine. If they were Americans, they'd already be banging and getting kicked out of the house. <laughs> okay. Green door or green room? Yeah, yeah, this is fine. It's not gonna be big. Yep. Fuck this bug. Get up on there. Hey, there you go. Okay. All right, I guess probably just go to the docks over there at noon. Yeah. I don't want to miss it. <laughs> that... the yeah, that right. way. Yeah. We'll get there early, but uh, yeah, just uh, cut to the park. Oh, that's right. What time is it? <laughs> okay. We will be changing the scenes. There we go. Perfect. あれ君が見送りに来てくれるとはね。あれ光はお母さんが帰るのに来てないの。うん。いつ帰るか教えてないの。変な親子でしょ。ガッティオ。You're so evil. <laughs> どういうこと悲しいから光もおばちゃんも帰る日を言わないし聞かないのかな皆様ごゆっくりお楽しみください。Damn. Damn. Um, could you set the time to slow? I want to make sure we can do everything today. Okay. I'm a little worried about it. That's, 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 that's totally fine. We can bump it back up after this. Yeah. All right, okay. now we got to go back to the house. So top down. What, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Boku. Yeah, down the stairs. <laughs> down the stairs. I don't want to miss the ghost girl either. If yeah. this, uh, it might be she might be gone, but if it's she's not, I'd like to say hi, right? <clears throat> and that makes total sense. Um, okay, oh man, all the rice balls are gone. That's because we took one. All right, be snacking, one. people be snacking, yeah, okay. Damn, she really did just leave it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go mend this family rift. <laughs> I feel like if this is what happened, I would like be so much more pissed. 
Um, like this. Yeah, this is fine yeah. this way. I like that our bike got brought back, but not Kenbo. I mean, he might be there today. We don't know. Yeah. Hey, we got a present for you. About to change your whole damn life. What? <laughs> ね。これお姉ちゃんのお母さんが置いてったんだけど、ここの鍵じゃないのかな?えどういうこと? They're both crying and he's just like, "Where's the ice cream?" I have pike in now. Well, homegirl, you can get to the fridge now, so, you know. Um, all right, I, we should go in and say hi. Yeah, it's just thinking. We've got family connected now. <laughs> no one can still bop it. Now they're both sat on the floor. No, we're good. Yeah. yeah, I don't think we're going to anything. Okay, let's go see if Kembo's there and maybe hit up the clinic. Oh, thank God. <laughs> no more running away, homie. But it was, you did a great, Boku, no. Oh, you're just going to do this every day, why, I guess. Why, why? Boku, I mean, and we're going to the clinic, so I guess we can just keep doing this. Oh. Oh, hey. Did you see a dog run by here? お姉さんね。その間骨以外をどうするの? <笑> 冬より夏の方が森の中にたくさん漂っているんだって。半ズボンで歩いたから、桃やふくらはぎをいっぱい蚊に刺されたけど、ちょっとだけ探検気分で楽しかったわ。Now ボンヤスミの渚さんも帰ってきて、当診療所にも活気が戻ってきたわい。僕の夏休みもついに残り半分じゃの。We got like 14 days left. This man's no. It's 
the seventies. You know, all these motherfuckers would be smoking. <laughs> right. Uh, down, I guess, is where Kembo is, right? Probably. That's where he was last time. It was this time he went up. No. Nope. Oh, he's not here. Well, it's up to you. We've got. Uh, <sighs> oh, it's about to be afternoon. Oh yeah. Well, Kembo will figure it out. Yeah, I guess if he just keeps coming home every day, it's not that big a deal. Yeah. But if you if you talk to him, I guess he's gonna run away every time. Yeah, damn. I don't know why we, we keep letting Kedbo off the leash suddenly. Like Oh yeah, no, Ghost is gone. Oh yeah, wow. Well That's a shame. Yeah. I feel like we really like kind of concluded it all that much, but I guess we did. I mean, she talked to the Gramps. Yeah, right? she talked to the like, Gramps, and then she talked to us and said, "I'm, I'm peacing out." So I guess that makes. Also, Obon's over. Yeah. Because like, is the is the idea she comes every Obon would be my guess, right? Mm -hmm. I guess well. we go see if the nurse is over by the. Um... That's what I was going to do. In the park where she used to hang. Yeah. Avoiding the uh, Dockman. We could also probably bombard speed up whenever you want. Oh, yeah. No rush. It's just. Um... No, it's always. Be... Not quick. Do not do quick. Oh, yeah, not quick. That's. <laughs> Get nothing done in this game. <laughs> to the right, to the right, oh, to the right, to the right. Yeah, right here. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, maybe she's hanging out with the dockman. Maybe she decided he's fine. Say, maybe she's, she's. No. Nope. No. no one over here. But he left on the boat, I guess, and it hasn't been come back yet. Where are you getting music from? What was that? We're getting music from somewhere. Oh, yeah. I don't know where that's from. There you go. He's clean. Oh. Oh, over here. Oh. Oh. ちゃん。その not off the dome. ねえ、その悲しい曲はどこの国の曲なのアルハンブラの思い出のことかなだったら多分スペインの曲だと思うねえ okay. Back. I, don't, I don't remember taking it. Yeah, but... I don't either. Hmm? Oh. 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 O
大事件が発生した。Something big has happened. ロック君、今日の晩ご飯は何だと思う Ooh, um, I say sardine fish ball soup. Okay. じゃあ、今日の晩ご飯、楽しみにしててね。Man, I don't want to live here and eat these meals. Right? <laughs> I feel like my entire life would be different if I had home cooked seafood every night. Yeah.、Uh, hmm. Yeah, we're, we're, it's going to be dinner in like two screens. Yeah. You can probably just go out to the dock and back. Say. Oi! Minna go hang yo! We should get a bonus for being right there at dinner time. We could help set the table. It's true. You think our shitty kids are helping set the table? No. We definitely are not. What? 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 Oh. oh. That'll be cool. I'm just swimming with the baby fry.、Uh, I guess let's go do our talk to the adults upstairs and、yeah. get our fortune told, and it's probably it. Yeah. I feel like we had a pretty big day, all things considered. Oh, check what we did for dinner. Oh, yeah.、Um... Yeah, right in the green room. Sea bream. It's funny because my, my guess was going to be sea bream. All right, grown ups. You being weird? No. Oh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Oh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Bank robber. What is it? まあとにかく興味があるのは人間だなそうなんだそれ僕もなんとなくわかるよへえ例えば寝ているおじちゃんの顔よーく見てると時々鼻の穴が大きくなるんだ<笑> Good. 寝て Great. Good job, Boku. See if Simon's in the room. Sam, where are you、nope. going? I don't know where he is at night. Yeah. Like, I know he takes photographs of the sunset, but then he should, you know. Yeah, but、well, he's just not, we're never running into him. I don't know.、Uh. If you know where Simon is at night,、uh, put a comment down below. Yeah. Just so、uh, I, we probably won't go there because I like doing the, this routine. This but way, yeah. If, if we need to do it to advance their relationship, I will, we will fucking go find Simon. We'll go find Simon. Yeah, damn it. We will drag his ass down. She's still moping in her room. And now she's moping with the door open and everyone's unhappy. Yeah, but she's like,、it. nothing fixed it. It didn't fix anything. It's like, yeah, that's how it gets sometimes. Sorry. Right. It's nice that you learned that lesson at like 16 and not 30 like everyone else. Sis, I'm trying to watch. Okay. Alright. I'll write these down. Guest house, second floor, room three. Alright. Interesting, because room three is Shizue's room, right? Yeah. And then Yasuko's at noon. Yasuko's room. Okay.、Uh, where's Gramps? That's a good question. Maybe check, he's. Check the bed. Maybe he's sleeping. Oh. Yeah, okay. He's sleeping.
私もう3年くらいお母さんに会ってないんだ。I'm on year seven, bitch. 高校の入学式の時も何度か振り返って、もう2の後ろの方を見てみたんだけど、見つけられなかったし。<笑>後でおじいちゃんに。お母さんも来てたんだよって言われて。But you're also not 16. ショックだった。It's true. 鍵も戻ってきたことだし、私、もうちょっと元気出さなきゃダメだよね。You're just a melancholy lady, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You're gonna grow up, it's gonna be the bubble economy, and you're still gonna be sad and wistful, and no one's gonna understand you. It's gonna be really romantic, like, broadly. <laughs> I'm just saying. Good. Alright, I'm gonna go here. Yeah, I, I just sort of knew where the fuck Simon was. Check the check the shed. Yeah, I guess we haven't. Nope, not there. No, nothing's here. I expected there to be scenes in this place. Yep. Oh. oh we fell asleep in this murder shed. <laughs> it's a good thing someone found us. God. <laughs> okay. Fell asleep in a murder shed. Woke up smelling like cat pets. Good night. She's the way I left today. I had to be the one to see up at the dock. <laughs> Damn. Boku, you got a little betta fish mouth. <laughs> oh that's, that's the mouth they have. It's the mouth ceviche has. Okay. Good night. Oh, eventful. Two Another, days. Yeah, wow. Boku, you have exhausted me. Yeah, I was going to say, if I had these two days, I'd be fucking lying down the next day. <laughs> Save our progress. No, we're done for this week, and we'll come back next week for more exciting adventures. With we are more than happy with this game now. I know, we are. Wow. Well then, M, what have you been up to this week? What you got going on? Oh plug, God, what do I have going on? Um. There's going to be a new Around the Long Fire on Tuesday um, about uh, Mort to Arthur still. Uh, what's going on? Is that the Tristram stuff? I think it's the Tristram stuff. Um, that guy. Uh, and then Wednesday will be GGP about Unicorn episode two. We talk a lot about Full Frontal and who the fuck that guy, whether or not it matters that he might be charismable and what we feel about that. It's a good episode. We have, a, despite the fact nothing happens in Unicorn episode two, we talk a lot about what it means that a uh, Kato voiced guy claiming to be charismable is running around. <laughs> yeah. And then Friday is VoIP life. I'm not actually on that. You're on that. I don't even know what it's about. Um, <laughs> I was in the group chat that we had. I was getting ready to go to the gym because <laughs> I was I was really I've had a really bad week at work. The next this week coming up is not going to be any better, honestly. But um, I was like, I don't have anything for VoIP. Can someone take over? And you helpfully uh, you helpfully volunteered. I appreciate. It. I'm really excited to listen to the episode. Um, and I'm getting ready to go to the gym because I'm like, I, a gym gym will fix me. It, ha it hasn't yet, but it might, <laughs> in theory. Um, and I just see you and Jackson sending images of like a fucking Turbo Graphics and a Mega Drive, and I was like, oh, what if I what if I crash this VoIP to, to hear about the console? <laughs> Jackson today told me if I had crashed it, I would have heard you talking about Yoshi P, and I would have quit the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good podcast <laughs> <laughs> because if i was if i had been enticed by uh, d ancient 16-bit consoles of yore and logged in only to hear you talk about final fucking fantasy i would have lost my goddamn mind <laughs> i'll say we did we we have a very solid through line throughout that podcast mm -hmm. um that does connect it um okay but uh yeah no we did I, we we I will simply say I started by asking Jackson Jackson why does a turbo graphic 16 fucking look like that um uh and I will state I am the I was the owner of a turbo graphic 16 I got that shit day one. one of one of 12 in America man um the part where you were just like a rich kid is very weird to me sometimes yeah 
No, because it's... you're mostly normal. You're not like an ideological villain. <laughs> well, no, because I hated. I I remember like when growing up, like growing up rich, and just like you know, my parents like constantly doing all this shit. And I'm like, I hate you. I think you're. I think you're. I think it was like, you know, five five. You know, like by like age like seven, I was like, my parents are ideologically evil. I don't know what to do with this. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, so. Um, I I love the PC Engine. I think it's so fucking cool. Um, yeah. um I but anyway, please look forward to that VoIP that's on our Patreon, patreoncom mapping for ten dollars. Also, new episode of uh, Dragon Readers should be out this week. Uh, that's recording on Tuesday. Me and Nora are talking about the end of Brissinger, which is the third Inheritance Cycle book. That's where me and my friend Nora read through the Aragon books. Um, some reveals, dramatic reveals have happened in those. Um, that I I, I don't. Un I don't understand why people think Star Wars is interesting as a plot, as what I'm going to say, as a preview for what we're going to talk about. Well, because it's the one, it's the monomyth, you see. <sighs> <There's>, <laughs> the thing is, there isn't just one monomyth. <laughs> I know. It's, it's really funny. Like, um, I went to school in the era where James Campbell was not um, discredited entirely. Because, like, mm -hmm. now now he is. Like, you mm -hmm. cannot, like, there's just, no, you just don't. Like, we talk about him as, like, a joke. But he was still somewhat, like, he was very much on the outs, but he was still there. You couldn't get around him. Uh, because ev all the scholarship was, you know, kind of interacting with him. So, like, you couldn't get mm -hmm. around. Um, but, yeah, like, no. <laughs> It's just like once you get out away from that, you're just like, God, this 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 asshole fucking sucks. Fuck him. yeah. Um, but that's it for us. In my spare time, I've been uh, playing every Shinobi and Alex Kid game. Ask me anything about Shinobi and Alex Kid. I don't understand the Alex Kid thing, but the Shinobi thing is interesting. Well, I w need to play Alex Kid and Shinobi World, and I was like, while I'm here, I might as well play the other Master and Alex Kid games. Yeah. I haven't played the I haven't played the uh, make a drive one yet i don't remember what it's called um that's the only ox kid i'm missing because there's only like fucking six alex kid games and one of them is like a bicycle game that you need a paddle controller that i don't have so i, I didn't play that one um shinobi i just have shinobi 3ds left. i'm a third way through that and then i'm gonna play nightshade and then i'm done with shinobi that's pretty good um, yeah you'll have to remind me you'll have to just tell me if nightshade uh is better or than Sh psx shinobi because or ps2 shinobi because i don't remember it well enough i, I mean i think i just remember ps2 being... shinobi's really good yeah uh, i assume it's kind of the same but like probably like a couple more interesting ideas but like feels cheaper would be my guess yeah I, how like, games I remember work. it like just like feeling like slightly off but like that it was doing more but okay um shinobi shinobi for the ps2 did not have a whole ton of ideas but it, it did it did do them fun I'm going to tell you, Shinobi has never had too many ideas. No, no. <laughs> as a as a newly forged expert on Shinobi, dude, the best part um, the best part about Shinobi was like in the arcade and getting to the 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 the, the end, like the, the the little like mini game where you throw shuriken at yeah. ninjas. That was the coolest yeah. shit. Like that was basically like the the attract mode too was just like they just showed that it was like this is sick let's play this game and then you're like why is this a beat em up what, what are we doing here okay fine i'll do this oh now we get to do the cool thing yeah because it's 1989 and that's just what video games were yeah. is the actual that's 87 actually i think yeah Maybe, um i played shinobi legions today that's the fucking fmv and uh digitized sprites shinobi for the saturn that game's fucking cool yeah. and by that i mean really cheesy but i liked it a lot <laughs> Yeah, I remember. I remember that. Uh, it plays a, really well considering it looks like that. As a Saturn owner, there weren't a whole lot of options, but uh, that was one. Then it was fun. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad you played Shinobi. through all the Shinobi games. I'm. We're gonna make you a Mega Drive person. Um, you know, I just we're gonna make you just a general like Sega like late '80s '90s person before. It's the so end weird because it. like, and then you'll become a bully. An a Nintendo person is so well defined because of the ubiquity of Nintendo franchises, right? Um, you got your Mario's and your Zelda's and your Poke, and like those are like distinct people. That's how like well defined the the Nintendo shit is. And Sega just doesn't have it like that. There's like Sonic people, and then there's there's the people who liked Fancy Star, which you know I played all those. They're fucking great. But like then it's like 
F fuck if I know. Well, <laughs> there's nothing. Like then you have like you have the sports people, and then you yeah. have but that breaks down into U.S. sports versus EU sports. Yes, and then you have like you know the baseball only people, and or you are yeah. the are the you know like it, it, it does it gets it get sad Sega gets all over the place. Um, it's so weird just seeing how much they're defined by um, their consoles never were in the lead. The only time they ever were like doing well is in the U.S. specifically for the Genesis, and that's it. <laughs> um, and they, they just never had to escape their arcade roots, and never really did. It's just really interesting going back. <laughs> yeah, no, this is because uh, I mean, like, like if you look at it, by the time the Famicom's over, you you could not tell that Nintendo used to make arcade games, basically. Yeah, no, like, it, and that was like that was the thing. That's why I liked about the Genesis is like it was like oh, these are all the arcade games that yeah. you play at home now. That's cool. Um, yeah. You know, I really like when the you know I ever told you you know oh play Alpha Three on the Saturn with the with the Rob card emulation. You're like I've already got Arcade Perfect. We have Arcade yeah, Perfect. Yeah, I, I have Alpha. Yes, I have Alpha Three in my uh, 30th anniversary Street Art collection. I could just play Alpha Three. Yeah, and it's like well we didn't have that then. So like per, like Arcade Perfect Alpha Three was like holy shit. This is the greatest and thing ever. Let's see the I PlayStation. I will say do to it. their credit, yeah, like it's interesting because I'm way more interested in like when they put shadow dancer out on the mega drive or uh, sorry the master system and it's like a disaster that game is terrible and the shadow dancer is an incredibly cool arcade game that just is like really technologically advanced and it's the only home port of it and it it's, runs like shit yeah uh, <laughs> because the gen the mega drive version that's called shadow dancer is like a basically an entirely new game like it has some of the same ideas but it's not the same thing yeah. at all no like um, they, they 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 completely did they did things to it yeah um, but i love when the port is just like totally different that's that's been the fun part of digging into all this stuff i played like six versions of shinobi like the original shinobi because every platform had a slightly different version of that video game i'm so mad i gave up on my my game gear before i tried shinobi 2 or gg shinobi 2 because oh it's fucking sick as hell it's so funny because like, i was like i was like man gg shinobi fucking rules like that was it's yeah and then, and then I was like, okay, I got, well, I'm like, well, I got one Shinobi. Uh, and then I was kind of like done with my my game gear, and I was like, well, I was playing those on my Steam Deck because uh, I could run them on my Analog Pocket, but I'm, I, there's no, I get save states and everything if I run on my Steam Deck, so yeah, I'll just do it that go. way. I don't really like. Uh, well, I use my Mister for basically everything else. Running uh, handheld games on the TV just looks bad. No, not a fan. Yeah, no, I was. I wasn't even a fan of that, even with the uh, the the Super, Super Game, Game Boy. Boy. Yeah, <laughs> it's like this looks bad. Yeah, even on like even on the, like the eleven inch uh, white Sanyo kitchen TV, the mom. Had. Oh, I didn't have any of those, but I I mean I did it because um, I wasn't eating through batteries when I was using Super Game Boy. So it was, you know sometimes it just behooved you to run it that way. Yeah, no, that's true. God, the Game Gear just destroyed batteries. Yeah, I never had a Game Gear. I, I just I just remember just like constantly just like breaking into like my stepfather's battery closet because he had just like a you know there's like three tiered shelves of just like mm -hmm. with just each like battery type in it. I was just like I'm just taking some of these triple A's and he'd be like Where are my triple A's? I'm like or double A's. I'm like I don't know, but you've been using them. And he was <laughs> like, Come on, just be just come, come clean on your triple A or your double A battery usage. Like no, I didn't use them. Fucking talking about old man. Um. But yeah, uh, you go through six uh, AA batteries using the TV tuner on the Genesis. Oh my god! Um, and then the then then when I graduated to the Turbo Express, the TV tuner on that, holy shit! The Turbo Express just destroyed batteries. Um, uh, I've never known anyone who's actually had a Turbo Express in my life. I didn't realize so you had a Turbo cool. Express. It was so cool. It's like, pretty cool. It, it, like the thing is like. It, it it was like ripping off the Game Boy, but it made it like they made it like it's just big and black and like it feels, it's got like a it's got like a lip around the screen. It looks like the thing that they use in Star Wars to like you know when they're like look when like Luke Skywalker's like looking around and shit on Hoth or whatever. It's like that. Um, yeah, it was so cool. Um, and it played it fucking played like Turbo Graphics games in it. <laughs> yeah, you just, they, it just took cue cards, right? Yeah, and it wasn't. It didn't need to be like ridiculous because the it, the cards were cards. They weren't yeah. fucking Genesis cartridges like the Nomad. Yeah, I didn't have a Nomad. Earl Jones had a Nomad. He brought it to school. Got broken. Okay. Yeah, I've never seen a Nomad <laughs> in person in my life. Uh, big, ugly, uh, played bad. But yeah. 
Wow, that was like a mini version of the VoIP life right there. Oh, there you go. Now, for $10, you can get me doing that with Jackson. Um, yeah. Only we we spin out into Yoshida and Square Enix's business practices. Well, yeah, the difference is I played a bunch of old games. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ja Jackson and I had a fun time with just Jackson just being young and being like, wait, what? <laughs> but it was a good time. Uh, I got nothing. I got I'm on VoIP life with 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 Jackson. Um, so go pay ten dollars to M uh, if you want anything from me this week. Otherwise, uh, you know, I'll do King's Quest five at some point. But my fish is not feeling well. So I, this week is kind of taken up emotionally by taking care of my little pal Ceviche. Um, so, you know, people of Earth, uh, send me your energy for the little guy. Um, and um... Then we'll be back next next time with 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 more king's quest or king, uh, king's quest five i think is what i'm going to be doing uh, the week after next mm. i'm still working on four because uh i just been busy and hadn't watched that i watched like maybe an hour of it yeah that one's a, it's a good one it's a good one for a dollar um there's like something really evocative about the idea of like this princess who's kind of bamboozled onto this quest she didn't really sign up for um by this fairy queen who just kind of dumps her um but then the game is just more king's quest bullshit i'm yeah, like no, please it... lean into this like mood this little wistful like fairy trails fairy tales will betray you um uh like legend kind of mood well and it, it really like it's so much of the the beginning of it really is like a oh i keep like you know solving all these problems for these like you know worthless guys and it turns out like all these like princes and stuff like that are just worthless guys yeah um and then but it, yeah, it never it never really pays into uh, the fairy who basically dupes you, and because yeah. like she's just like I can save your dad if you do this, and then it's like okay, if you come with me, and then you get there, and it's like oh I'm actually dying, and I don't have any magic anymore, and I need you to take care of my bitch sister, and it's yeah. <laughs> it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't do enough with it, but like I guess I don't know. Um. I'm interested to see how that then finds its way with, I know King's Quest seven is a return to Rosella, only it's Rosella and, uh, Valenice, uh, together. What? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And so Valenice gets a personality and it turns out there's like mama daughter drama. So, uh, so that's, that's gonna either going to be like fascinating or the worst thing I've ever seen. Yeah, there's I've, no middle ground. And I've heard both both sides of that. Like I've heard like okay. there there's really interesting. Stuff and I heard like wow, that was like the worst horrible thing I've ever attempted to play. So yeah, when we get there, we'll get there, and it'll be fun to see what that's like. Because I I did not play um, the Jafar game. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, other than that, um, you know, next week we'll do another one of these and also I'll be continuing my trek through the ringed city DLC of dark souls three with Trevor on Thursday. So, uh, look forward to that. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube if you haven't already, so you don't miss it. Um, last week we got real Philly and we talked shit about CNN, um, specifically CNN anchors who were terrible. Um, yeah. Yeah, uh, God knows what we'll talk about this week. <laughs> but also the Ring City DLC might be bad. I'm not sure. It might be amazing, and it might also be the worst thing ever uh, simultaneously. So it's a fun time to come watch me struggle with those feelings about Miyazaki. Fair enough. Yeah. Other than that, I guess that's that's an episode. So... We'll see you next week, everyone. Bye. Bye.